Hey, my name is Eric Godsey. I'm the product owner for Connex, and I wanted to walk you through how to self-service and set up a partnership by inviting a company or partner who's not on Connex yet. So when you log into Connex, you can come to the company menu on the left and click on partners. Here you will see all of the partners you've already established for ticket sharing. On the right hand side, you can go to actions and new partner connection. So here you have the option of entering an email address or a company name for a search to see if they're already on the platform. If you know that they're not on the platform, you can begin by entering the company name that you would like to call them. You can then choose the role or relationship that they are to you. So in this case, they're going to be a carrier for me and enter in the email address of the company administrator for this partnership and simply hit save. The system will sometimes prompt you to make sure that this person is not already on the system. In this case, James Godsey at yahoo.com is already on quite a few entities, but I don't see it in the list. So I'm going to hit save anyway, which will start the workflow for a new company invitation. So now that we've created that record, you can open it back up and preemptively establish your ticket sharing rules so that tickets will be ready and waiting as soon as that person self onboards through the invite email. So you can open it through new rule and establish the information that will control how your tickets are shared. So you can set an effective date, you can go ahead and enable it, and then you can choose how you want to share these tickets based on the name of the carrier of the ticket, supplier, customer, project, or product. You can then choose what part of the ticket or tickets to share. So if you wanna share the location times and batch results, maybe the test results and any images. You can then choose to grant privileges for them to reshare that ticket information to their partners. Once you're satisfied with this, you can hit save. So once your partner gets the invitation email and invokes the link, they are presented with this wizard. It gives them the opportunity to finish setting up their company and their personal information, as well as agree to the privacy policy and legal agreements. So they can set a time zone, confirm the name of their company. They can finish filling out their personal information and then review the privacy policy and end user license agreement. And then finally, they can review this information. Once they press complete registration, the entity and their tenancy is automatically created. If you had already set up your partnership ticket sharing rules, tickets are already available as soon as they log in. Otherwise, you'll need to establish that on your own.